Hi everyone, I'm Professor Wilkins and this is the Yoke with a Gathered Skirt tutorial. The yoke on the skirt is a fitted band at the top which usually replaces a waistband. However, there are skirts that have a waistband and a yoke. Most yoke on the skirt extends from the waist to the upper hip. The remainder of the skirt extends from the bottom of the yoke. Label the center back on the back skirt. And the center front on the front skirt. Draw a half an inch seam allowance extending from the center back. Measure one and a half inches down from the back skirt waistline. Draw a line that is parallel to the waistline. <coughs> Measure one and a half inches down from the front skirt waistline. Draw a line parallel to the waistline. Label the back yoke. Label the front yoke. Divide the skirt below the yoke into five even panels. Measure out seven eighths of an inch from the center back and draw a vertical line from the bottom of the yoke to the hem of the skirt. Draw another line 7 eighths of an inch away from the first. Continue until there are five panels. Measure out 7 eighths of an inch from the front skirt side seam and draw a line from the bottom of the yoke to the hem of the skirt. Draw another line 7 eighths away from the first. Continue until there are 5 panels. Starting from the center back, label the panels from 1 to 5. Starting from the center front, 
label the panels from one to five. Make sure all of your yoke lines are connected. Starting from the center back, number each section of the yoke. Cut out the back yoke pieces. Connect the pieces of the back yoke together and tape down. Cut out the front yoke. Cut in between the darts, leaving a little bit of a hinge so that the darts can pivot close. Pivot and close the front darts and tape down. Fold a sheet of paper in half horizontally. Place the yoke center front on the fold and tape down. Add a quarter inch seam allowance all the way around. Draw the grain line parallel to the center front. Cut out the center front yoke and keep the other half of the paper for the center back yoke. Open the remaining folded paper. Place the center back yoke on the fold line and tape down. Add in seam allowance at the side yoke, the waist line, and the bottom of the yoke. You do not need to add any at the center back because half an inch was already added in the beginning for the zipper. Draw a green line parallel to the center back and then cut out the pattern.
tape three pieces of paper together horizontally for the front skirt. Flip the three connected sheets around and tape the back as well. Tape two pieces of paper together horizontally for the front skirt. Flip the connected paper around and tape the back as well. Cut out the back skirt panels. Measure up one and a half inches from the bottom of the paper and draw a horizontal line all the way across. Draw a vertical line a quarter inch away from the right edge. Place the fifth panel at the intersection of the vertical line and the horizontal hemline. Tape down. Measure two and a half an inch over. Mark. Square up a vertical line. Tape down the fourth panel. Continue to measure each panel two and a half inches apart, draw a vertical line, and tape down. Use the ruler to draw in the waistline. Add a quarter inch seam allowance at the side and the waistline. Draw in the grain line parallel to the center back. Label yoke skirt. Back. 
cut to cut off the pattern at the zipper extension the side seam and the waist line Cut out the front skirt panels. Fold the three sheets of connected paper in half. Set the paper so that the folded edge is on the right. Measure one and a half inches up from the bottom of the paper and draw a horizontal line across. Place the center back of the first front panel on the folded edge. Tape down. Measure two and a half inches from the first panel. Mark and draw a vertical line up. Place the second front panel at the corner of the horizontal and vertical line. Tape down. Continue to measure all of the panels two and a half inches apart. Draw a vertical line and tape down. Use the ruler to connect the waistline. Add a quarter inch seam allowance at the waistline. and at the side seams. Draw the grain line parallel to the center front. Label yoke skirt. Front, cut one. Keep the paper folded and cut at the waist line. 
and at the side seams. Introducing the yoke skirt front. The yoke skirt back. The back yoke. And the front yoke. 